Wesley Chapel on April 24, the Pasco County Commission approved the Epperson Club's request to sell alcoholic beverages in the Swim Up Bar alongside the nation's first Crystal Lagoon in Metro Development Group S2000 home Epperson neighborhood. But what the county DID and T approve were the actual building permits for the bar, nor the surf shop, restrooms, tiki huts and other structures nearing completion. That is because nobody thought to apply for the permits to construct 11 buildings and 8 cabanas for the high-profile project along the 7.5-acre Crystal Lagoon. After a Pasco County fire inspector discovered the oversight May 10, the county shut down construction, pulling the plug on the Lagoon's planned May 19 opening. Of course we want the development to proceed and be prosperous. That's good for the county, but we have to ensure the individuals using that area are safe, said Anthony Mastracchio, Pasco's deputy building official. The amenities appear on the county-approved site plan, said Greg Singleton, president of Metro Development Group. And the property was hosted to public events in April a grand opening celebration featuring Olympian Michael Phelps and the Pasco Economic Development Council's annual fundraising networking party, it wasnt like we secretly build stuff in the middle of the night, said Singleton. Nonetheless, Metro Development Group was responsible for obtaining the appropriate permits, Mastracchio said. Construction escaped county attention because Metro used private, third-party inspectors to oversee the work, as state law allows. That meant county inspectors were never on site. Private building officials, however, are prohibited from conducting fire inspections, which prompted the May 10th visit by the county fire inspector. Metro Development Group has since applied for its permits and Pasco County began processing the applications Tuesday, beginning a 10-day review. The company has not set a new date for the Crystal Lagoon's first day of operation, it will be weeks, not months as soon as we have the permits, said Singleton. He said approximately 175 homes in the development are occupied and another couple hundred home sites are under contract or in various stages of construction. The Crystal Lagoon, a man-made lake that uses trademark technology to maintain clear, clean water, is the centerpiece amenity in the Epperson development. Metro Development Group also is building Crystal Lagoons at its projects at South Shore Bay in Southern Hillsboro and at Marotta, north of Epperson in Pasco County. Contact CT. Bowen at via email protected or 813-435-7306. Follow at Seat Bowen 2 Related, Crystal Lagoon to open in spring. Related, Crystal Lagoon holds ribbon cutting. Related, Michael Phelps to headline grand opening. More, go here for more business news.